Today I show you a really interesting trick that you can do with your iPhone. You can select text from pictures. And normally when you have a picture saved on your phone, you wouldn't be able to read the text from the picture. For example, now I could take a screenshot of my home screen. So that's a screenshot right there. I could also go to my website here. I could go to my website. You could have a screenshot of this. For example, it's not saved as a text. So it's saved as a screenshot and you might, you might have this from someone else. Someone else would send you a screenshot through a chat, through a telegram. Someone else could send you a screenshot from WhatsApp or from an email. And if you want to select the text from the screenshot to search on Google, for example, you can do that. It's really easy. On iPhone, you can simply select the text from your pictures like this. So open the photos up. I have the photos up open and I could even read a QR code. The photo is saved on my iPhone and you see this small icon here, right there. It's really easy. Okay, so I press this button and now it's ready. If I tap on the QR code, it will show me what's the content of the QR code. I could copy it, I could search the web for it. This is another QR code and I will have the same thing here. I'll have the same option there. And this is the address. So I could open in Chrome. That's going to go to the website because the, the QR code is basically just uh, eonhowto.com or ion, ionhowto.com. You can do this with QR codes, but you can also do it with pictures. For example, here I have this, this text. For example, here I have this thumbnail and I can do this option. So I have the website address right there. It recognized that one. And maybe this text, no, it was still copied. So I could copy this one. Search the web. So it's searching for merch because that's written there. I could do the same on the logo here. Search for Eon. Search web. It's really working. Even if the font is a little bit different, it will work. And this works really good on articles. So you select. I'm not sure if I would be able to select the text from here, but let's try. So I could select even the text from the photos, which is not very easy to read. I could select it simply like that. It's really, it's really useful. This is the screenshot I did earlier. And it's a photo. You see, this is a photo here. It's two megapixels. It's nothing, nothing too special. And if you see, they have, you have the icon there, right there. So you can get some information. Okay. So I close the information there. Okay. So I close the information there and you have this. You have this thing to read, but actually you don't need to press on that. All you have to do is press somewhere on the picture, long press, and you select the text just like it's in a website, like it's on a page. You can select the text just like that. So I could start from here, test it on, select this paragraph or select the whole thing, select all. This would work really well on the long screenshot. And I select all, and now I have the option to copy. Copy the text. I have a new note, paste, paste, and really, it might not be perfect. Here's, here are some of the icons. iPhone change brightness settings. I guess these were because of the screenshot, so it's from the picture. You see, it really got everything from here, even this small text from the thumbnail. So it's selecting Firefox, productivity, all that. Everything is here. You might have to still adjust some of this, but you can use AI to adjust the text, to fix, to remove the errors. And that's really useful to use images like they are documents. I hope this helps you get text out of your pictures on your iPhone. Thanks for watching. This is really magic, like magic. It's using OCR. 
But it's using OCR, it's so easy to do it.